giving you a voice, making it loud our own way. Welcome, Welcome to, to the fun. fun. So let's get started here with our uh, countdown. So coming in at uh, number 50, we have FTC 11166 Big Red Robotics with the Kathari robot, uh, which is a shoe and floor sanitization robot that uses UV light and a scrubbing mechanism. And at 49th place, we have FTC 11770 uh, Curiosity with Beachy, the cleanup robot, uh, which is a low cost robotic beach trash cleaning robot. And then at 48th, we have 13601, the beaver bots, uh, with a really cool robot that works to remove microplastics from waterways uh, autonomously. Very cool. And then 47th place, we have FTC 12997 uh, Cosmos with a robot that takes temperatures and evaluates if a person uh, should be let into a business establishment due to COVID-19. Very cool. And then in 46th place, that is Dave. Go ahead, Dave, take it away. We have FTC 7149, uh, the EHD PAL enforces with Project Apollo. It's a robot that provides COVID test kits to patients uh, waiting in cars for protection purposes. And at 45, we have Quantum Stingers FTC Number 13380, uh, it's a disinfecting robot designed to sterilize surfaces in stores and hospitals to prevent uh, the spread of ba uh, bacteria. At 44, we have FRC number 1156 under control. Uh, it's nicknamed the Ocelot and it's capable of detecting illegal deforestation efforts and reporting the location of those uh, activities to the authorities. At number 30, at number 43, we have FRC team number 6636 uh, with full metal beavers. This is a robot that sorts trash to find recyclable materials. Great, and then at 42, we have FRC team number 4272, the Maverick Boiler Robotics team. Um, who built a product safe snack robot that delivers snack items to patients to maintain zero contact and reduce the spread of germs further within a hospital. The next at 41, we have FTC team number 479, um, Fusion. This robot helps guide visually impaired people through unfamiliar buildings by navigating around obstacles, adjusting to the user's speed, and then responding to voice input. Then at number 40, we have FTC team number uh, 9784, Dry Ice, who made the Ventilator X robot as a low cost autonomous ventilator. And then at 39, we have FRC team number 900, the Zebracorns, who made a low cost bomb and explosive disposal robot. And uh, for team number 38, or uh, uh, submission number 38, winner number 38, we have FRC uh, number 272, the Cyber Crusaders. The Clarence APD, the Autonomous Package Delivery Robot, can uh, deliver packages and climb stairs. For no, uh, winner number 37, we have team number 13180, Rover Drive. The main function of CLEAR, which stands for Clean, Cleaner Equipped Autonomous Robot, is to clean any surface, no matter its height or orientation. Number 36, is team number 14278, which is Zio. The Charybda robot identifies, collects, and compacts trash from the top of the ocean. And number 35 is from team number 16156, R cubed. The PPU robot is a mask PPE waste pickup system. And at number 34, we have FTC 14020 Nemesis Prime with the Buddy Bot, which acts as an item grabber robot and works with Frog Forces robot that acts as a cart. At 33, we have FRC 2830, the Riverside Robo Tigers, uh, with a robot that delivers clups to patients in nursing homes using a manual storage system and delivery system that allows nurses more well 
uh, more time to tend to the patient's well-being. And then at 32, we have FTC 14969 Vortex uh, with a robot designed to deliver medicine and other supplies to patients in hospitals. And then 31, we have FTC 14535 Alpacas with a medical facility robot that uses UV light to sanitize surfaces and other objects in order to help prevent the spread of germs and disease. And coming up at number 30, we have FTC T number uh, 048, WizTech. Um, they've created a telemedic robot uh, that's a no contact robot that monitors patients' health uh, in order to limit the spread of contagions. At 29, we have FTC 12731, Bulldog Robotics, uh, a UVC light patrol bot that sanitizes grocery store shelves uh, with UVC lights. At 28, we have uh, FTC team number 16598, Rebel Robotics, uh, which is a microplastic extraction robot uh, that, uh, that autonomously removes microplastics from fra fragile ecosystems such as coral reefs. And at 27, uh, we have FTC uh, team 7462 with their robot not to scale, great name. Uh, uh, and this floor robot, F-Lore, uh, collects litter and trash from roadways. And then at 26, yep. um, we have FTCT number 14486, the asteroids with a floor sanitizing autonomous robot that uses UVC light. Then at 25, we have FRC team number 1836, the Milk and Knights with their robot that's a firefighting robot with a hose nozzle mounted on it. Then team number 24, is FTC team number 7039, Lord of the Bricks, a decontamination capsule for mail, packages, and other small items. And then number 23 is FRC team number 2976, the Sparta Bots. Um, they have a trash bot that's designed to clean up roadside trash and litter. Thank you, you muted, John. I wasn't muted. I was waiting for that bumper to come up here. Team number 22, is, uh, <laughs> winner number 22, FTC number 151 is StarTech. Uh, it's a robot that selectively uh, recycles uh, that uh, items that are collected by another robot. Number 21 is from uh, team number 10396, Raiders of the Ark Silver. I mean, these names are great. It's still, I have to say, not to scale is one of my favorites. But the Galileo robot assists doctors in operations and treatments and it's just patients who are in isolation due to COVID. Uh, number 20, it's uh, from team number 13162, Apollo. This, the disinfect bot is a hospital disinfecting robot that works with another robot to deliver items in the hospital. And number 19 is from FTC number 2142, G-Force. The multi-purpose emergency respondent uh, companion, Merck, it's a multi-purpose robot that can respond to any emergency whether uh, where liquid or an aerosol needs to be deployed. And then in 18th, we have FTC 2123, the Mad Engineers. Uh, the Atom robot here is a robot designed to replace the role of pharmacists, cashiers, and security guards. In 17th, we have FTC 7519, Cougar Botics with Mr. Assistant, uh, a robot that's designed to support nurses in a hospital setting by delivering food and medication to patients. And then at number 16, we have FRC 1466 Web Robotics, uh, a disinfecting robot that sanitizes packages to prevent the spread of COVID-19. And then in 15th, we have FRC 8027, not the droids you're looking for, love that name, uh, with their nurse bot, which checks patients at the entrance of a hospital for symptoms to limit virus exposure for medical professionals. Coming up at number 
14, we have FRC Team 7461 with Sushi Squad. Uh, this robot's a portable trash and debris collector that pulls trash from tight spaces. And at number 13, uh, we have FRC Team 223 with Extreme Heat. Uh, it's a grocery bot that efficiently and inexpensively collects groceries uh, in a standard grocery store and transfers as a delivery service. At number 12, we have FRC Team 2992 uh, with the SS Prometheus. This robot is designed to lift and raise a companion robot uh, and groceries to help prevent contamination and spread of viruses. And at number 11, we have FRC Team 1197 uh, Torbots with the Torbox robot. Um, and this is a package delivery robot that assists UPS drivers while keeping their de their deliveries uh, within their deliveries while keeping them safe. And then team number 10 is FRC 5414 Paradox. Um, the product extracting autonomous automatic robot moves objects to aid the elderly or physically impaired. And then in number nine, keeping with that fruit theme is FRC team number 2067. Apple Pie, with a curbside delivery robot that helps a local business deliver produce to customers waiting in cars. Thank you. Awesome. Thank you, everybody. A great job on those robots and great names. We were talking about it as a judges team and just wondering what all the stories were behind these names because we're sure there are stories behind them. We'd love to hear them at some point. Um, so congratulations to the top 50. Obviously, you know, we got from number 50 down to number nine. You'll see the remaining eight later on in the show. The Robots to the Rescue Challenge on First Updates Now is brought to you by PTC. Don't forget that you can register for Onshape for free and start designing right in your browser at onshape.com forward slash education dash plan.